I get a lot of DMs from fans, but the one I got yesterday was truly special. Yoav hit me up with a project he was working on, Pretty TS Errors, and man, did I fall in love with it fast. After tweeting about it, it's clear I'm not the only one who's hyped about this. I wanted to do a quick video showing off my new favorite VS Code plugin. It's already made my life so much better, and I hope it helps y'all out as well. So here's the plugin, it's on GitHub, I'll post a link in the description. This is not the same as the TS Error translator that Matt Pocock created before. In fact, you can even see in here, there's a link to it whenever you have an issue. I will be clear though, I find this plugin significantly more useful because I'm already used to reading the errors. The benefit of the plugin isn't it makes it easier to understand a TypeScript error that you may not have understood before. It's that it's a new syntax to prettify in those dense, hard to read errors in a much more readable syntax. We have a basic type here for a user object that has a couple nested fields within it, as well as a get user function that would be used to fetch one of these user objects. We also have an implementation of this function. However, as you see here, it is failing. And if we were to only look at this error, it's a lot of parsing you have to do. I'm used to looking for a tab, so I look for the tab break. And here, property friends is missing in this big old blob here, but it's required in type user. Okay, that's a lot going on and a lot of characters to parse through just to figure out that this field is missing. And if I scroll down, you can see this much more readable error. And this is what the plugin gives you. Suddenly, name, string, posts, title, string, comment, body, string, all shows correctly. This might be useful here, but now let's imagine that this type doesn't exist in this file. Okay, we've exported all the types. We have moved this over. Well, we see we're still getting an error. Friends is missing. Let's quickly add friends. Now that we've added that, we're still getting an error though. What's going on? Let's use the plugin some more. Oh, is subscribe to Theo? That's strange. I guess we have to add that property is subscribed still erroring what's up oh is subscribed to theo is not assignable to true huh maybe if you were subscribed we would have been able to finish this faster but since y'all haven't subscribed the whole video has to be held up now for everybody so come on subscriptions are free hit that button so we can get back to showing you the cool stuff and there we go look at that we have the get user function we're not getting any errors anymore since we're only using a type import here i can do import type get user and yeah, suddenly things got much easier to debug. Even if we have a nested field in here like body, we hover over, see the error. Yes, it's hugely nested, but this view makes it so much easier to see. Type posts.comments are incompatible between these types. Tab in again, body string is not assignable to text string. Property text is missing to in type body string, but required in type text string. So much easier to understand these deeply nested errors now. If, you have, if you've never seen a blob like this in your type errors, I'm a little bit jealous, but now they're readable inside of VS Code. This is hype. It even works inside of JSX, TSX, JS doc, Astro, and Vue, and a bunch of other TypeScript syntax languages that have different file extensions. So you're good to go pretty much no matter what you're using as long as it's TypeScript based. Goddamn, this plugin is super cool. I'm so hyped for Yoav. It had 200 stars when he linked it to me. We broke over 1500 just from the tweets. So let's see how many stars we can get this project because it deserves way more. I honestly think pretty much every TypeScript user in VS Code should at least try this extension and see if it benefits them as much as it's helped me. Thank you, Yov, for hitting me up with such a cool project. It's an honor to be the one to share this with the greater TypeScript community. You're the one who did all the hard work though. So seriously, y'all, please reward him with a star and a share. If you wanna know more about how to keep TypeScript from blocking you and move fast as a team building TypeScript, video about all that there. Check it out if you haven't already. Thank you guys as always. Peace nerds.